So today I'm going to show how to turn a plain old lampshade into a really easy hanging lamp. So start with a plain lampshade. This is one from a lamp whose base had shattered and couldn't be saved. You want to get some rubber stamps because who wants a plain lamp? And I use chalk ink on this because it gives it kind of a dusty look. Um, but if you want something brighter colored, you could use a different kind of ink as well. So ink up your stamp. I find the chalk ink really works well on fabric, which is another reason I used it. Then you want to take something hard. I'm using a tea tin here. And you just want to stamp your stamp right across where the hard surface is. Just like that. And you just go all the way around doing your stamps against the hard surface. I'd switch to a CD because it was actually easier than the tea tin I found. So there's the bottom of my lamp with the stamps all the way around. And then I also put a little set of stamps across the top. Um, but they didn't turn out as well because I couldn't fit the hard surface in there. So I had to use my hand and my hand is not that hard. So it just it didn't work as well as the ones on the bottom. But fortunately, most of the mistakes were on one side, so I can just turn that side toward the back wall. So then you want to get yourself a bottle lamp kit, and it comes with three plugs. And in this case, we're going to use all three of them. So screw on the biggest one. And then there should be a little bit of sticking out, so screw the second biggest one on there, right on the bottom of that. And then take your light socket and take it apart. Make sure the cardboard ring is in the bottom and then just screw that on the other side of the screw. If you look in your instructions, it'll tell you how to do this. And then tighten down your screw so that's securely fastened on there. So then take your cord and slip it through the hole at the top of the lampshade and slip it through the little metal disc that comes with the kit. And now there's two wires. They're a little bit different, so Slip them up through the bottom of the socket and then read your instructions very carefully to make sure you put the correct wire on the correct side. I've been doing this since I was about 12 and haven't accidentally killed myself yet. But if you're not comfortable with electricity, you might want to have somebody help you with this part. But if you just read the instructions, it's actually pretty simple because the wires are a little bit different and they tell you which side to screw them into. Once you got those screwed on, connect the gold cover and then take the third of the little plastic circles and you want to tape that on top of the other the stack of the other two just using some electrical tape and then take another piece of electrical tape and tape your cord to that top circle this will help centerize the cord and make sure the weight of the light bulb doesn't pull the wiring out of the bottom of the socket and so now you want to make sure that the cord is going to hang straight so take a little bit of strong glue that will bond plastic and metal and you just want to glue that stack of plastic circles to the bottom of the metal disc, making sure that the cord is nice and centered. And then let that dry. And once that's dry, you just want to glue the metal disc to the top of the lampshade so that when you let it hang, the cord hangs perfectly straight and the bulb is straight and not touching the side of the lamp. And so on the inside, the bulb hangs down enough that you should have plenty of room for your hand to be able to reach up and turn it on and off. Or